Did you know that Tchaikovsky wrote the most iconic solo for the bass clarinet? But first, what the heck is a bass clarinet? Most people know what a clarinet is. The bass clarinet plays an octave lower, so it is much bigger. And it's a standard member of the orchestra clarinet section. But usually, when we think about bass clarinet solos in the orchestra, we think of Strauss or Wagner, like the solo from Rhine Journey. So how did Tchaikovsky end up writing the most famous bass clarinet solo? He didn't even write a bass clarinet part in his three big symphonies. Well, an instrument was invented in the late 1800s called the Celeste, which is a set of bells played by a keyboard. Composers ran out to write for it, including Tchaikovsky in the Nutcracker. To balance the high tinkly sound, he wrote this low solo for the bass clarinet. Here's that famous solo in Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairies that I recorded during a dress rehearsal. And again, that's what I love about Tchaikovsky. <laughs> 